So I remember my first day of pharmacy school thinking, what am I going to wear? Do I need to dress really fancy or, you know, can I wear tennis shoes? Do I have to wear long black socks? What am I going to wear? I showed up, I dressed pretty nice, polo shirt, khaki pants, nice dress shoes. And I remember seeing this one guy, he had a full on suit and a tie. And I was like, oh shoot, was I supposed to dress up really nice? But luckily, um, he was the only one who did that. Uh, that was his accident. <laughs> and I was right, and now I have learned through time what exactly to wear for pharmacy school. So hey guys, my name is Micah, I'm a pharmacy student, year dose, and today we're going to go through how to dress for pharmacy school, at least for men. So, come on, come on with me. We're gonna look at all the clothes that I have. First off, let's look at my pants. So these are my go-tos. I got these from American Eagle. They are tan khakis. I have another pair, those are from H&M. They're a little bit skinnier fit. I don't really like the extremely baggy. These kind of look baggy, but they're, they're pretty skinny fit on my legs, but not like ultra skinny to make me look fat. Uh, these are black. They're not like super silky, if you could tell. They feel really comfortable, but they're all but they're still dressy. Uh, these were also from H and M. And these are a little bit uh, more blue. They're kind of navy. I'm colorblind, so luckily my wife helps pick out my my clothes for me. I got those from a wedding. I don't remember. And then these bad boys I got from Target, and they're actually pink. Uh, yeah. I kid you not, I got them for $7, uh, maybe even $5 after, because we have a Target card, you get a percentage off. You get so many compliments on this. Here's my belt. It is reversible. I highly recommend that. So you can do brown one day or black another day, depending on the other clothes that you wear. Now let's go to my shoes. So I have these just... Pretty nice black shoes. I had these for probably my first six months of pharmacy school. And of course, when you wear black shoes, you wanna wear a black belt, so just reverse it. I have two pairs of brown shoes. These ones are, they actually look nicer. Sorry, the lighting's not the greatest, but uh, they were pretty dang cheap. I think I got them at Ross for like 20 bucks. And then these guys were, these are my most expensive shoes. I actually don't remember where I got them. Just some shoe store in the mall. They were around $70, but they had a sweet deal. And then my socks. So you can just wear, you know, normal long black socks, brown socks, whatever. But I like to get the kind of fancier ones. People don't see your socks that much, but these are flamingos, polka dot stripes, tacos. Those are my favorites. And purple. Let's go over here. My pharmacy school, I'm pretty sure all pharmacy schools, you have to have a name tag. It's magnetic, you can clip it on. You don't have to wear that every day, but if you have certain assignments where you have to dress up like a pharmacist, or if like people are coming in, they want you to look fancy, or I'm an ambassador, so I have to wear it when students come to investigate the school. And then here's my watches, I recommend watches they even if they don't tell the time like you can see none of my watches actually work all the batteries are dead this one's a fake rolex you can get that in chinatown in new york city or down in mexico i got mine for i think thirty dollars real rolexes are like five thousand dollars <laughs> uh this is just a kind of a plain gold watch i got for 10 bucks uh this is a little bit nicer gold watch i got for around 100 this I got at Target. It's just, uh, you know, fancy, but not extremely like gold or silver. I got that at Target. Okay, so let's go to, oh yeah, and here's some more pants I just have hanging right there. Those are some brown ones. Uh, I believe I got those at Target as well. But yeah, let's go to my shirts. So you wanna wear either a full on button shirt or my favorites are just the partial button. It's hard to see. I really love this black shirt. I, I love this white shirt. 
they still, you know, I, they're, they're called polos, right? Uh, this blue shirt, a little bit different, black, green. Also, you can wear fancier shirts if you really want to with the long sleeves. You could wear white shirts. I would not wear a tie unless it's like a special occasion. I would not wear a suit as well unless you're like um, going for president of some organization. Uh, there's a blue, nice blue shirt. So I just want to end with a quote that says, dress like you're going somewhere better later. Honestly, dressing is, it, it makes you feel better. It makes you feel more successful. It makes you feel more confident. I know some pharmacy schools don't require a full on dress up with a, you know, button up shirt and nice pants. But I would recommend it just because it makes you feel better um, when you're more confident then you're going to be able to, you know, make those network connections easier. And I think you'll you do better on quizzes and tests. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you like this video. I hope you subscribe and make sure to eat, eat your vegetables. It's good for you. Go run a mile or something. And hey, you rock. <laughs> See you later.